if they are asking for those documents. Now, if the stakeholder does not believe that, or if the stakeholder believes that there is something wrong, then they must, again, file a grievance. But let's understand something. We are not, this board, let me just speak for myself, we, I am not going to withhold, withhold information because there's nothing to withhold. This is a volunteer position. So understand this, that we do not intend to try to mistreat you, unfairly create any conflict for you, or create a hardship for you. <laughs> now, the reason why previously we would not work with you is because you're rude, crude, tacky, and disrespectful. Oh, 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 oh. I will speak, please. We have another board member's comment. It seems to me that at this point in time, we have folks who have grievances who are dangling in the wind while we go play ping pong with them. Mm -hmm. I would much rather, at least speaking as the chair of this organization, take the risk that whoever the people are, somebody has a quibble with, than that we do nothing. Uh, <coughs> because, you know, at least it moves the process forward, and where we are right now, nothing's going nowhere. So, yes, sir. Mr. Chair, um, quite some time ago, um, I believe the the board had assembled some documents that were in responsive to the grievance requests, and um, a charge was being required for the grievant to get those documents. I'd like to move that any documents that we have previously assembled or can be assembled within the next week be made available in our offices okay for for her to take no cost are you talking about public records requests <laughs> yeah if, if you guys have records that you've been sitting on well you turned them down they offered you a package of things oh, no, for no, 200 no. bucks absolutely there was a, excuse me i am going to speak out here because i'm a witness to what was assembled. I can provide the tape for that as well. And, and what was assembled was a bunch of gobbledygook that had absolutely nothing oh, I to do. It was relevant. It was no. The, so what you were offered wasn't relevant. What I was offered was completely irrelevant. Uh, and I asked an impartial witness to look through it to make sure before I handed it back and said no. As for the $200 charges, as long as you brought them up, and I'm glad you did. Um, after I went to Don and raised Cain about somebody attempting to charge me, what was that, 15, 16 times the going rate for a copy, um, that was backed down on. Uh, but it took getting Don involved to convince Bradley that he could not be punitive in charging me that amount. I'm sorry, Mr. Chair. Um, I do have, I have some time. documents. I have some documents that were responsive to some of the multiple public records requests that I made. But there were some documents, a huge stack, with a bill on top for a large amount, that were basically copies of other organizations' flyers. I mean, you know, there's stuff that you'd pull out of your mailbox or that maybe you guys get in your mailbox. They were not responsive to my request. Okay, Bradley, uh, yes. we have a point of personal privilege, and then we're going to move on to this since it's evident that on the merits, this is not going to go anywhere tonight. So, yes, sir. Thank you so much, Mr. Uh, Chair. There's a motion on the floor. Okay, there is a motion on the floor. Uh, the motion. I yield. Okay. First and foremost, let me just say for the record, there were over 500 documents that were provided to the grievant on the Public Request Act. Absolutely not. Excuse me, I'm speaking now. I know, Thank I you. interrupted. Um, and there have also yeah. been there have also been responses to any of the Public Records Act requests, and there were three Public Record Act requests, and there have been legitimate responses. Now, with regard to the cost, with regard to the cost of the documents, that information was provided to us by done and they made the decisions on the amount of funds that we are to request from any grievance if they are asking for those documents now if the stakeholder does not believe that or if the stakeholder believes that there is something wrong then they must again file a grievance but let's understand something 
we are not this poor. Let me just speak for myself. We, I am not going to withhold, withhold information because there's nothing to withhold. This is a volunteer position. So understand this, that we do not intend to try to mistreat you, unfairly create any conflict for you, or create a hardship for you. <laughs> now, the reason why previously we would not work with you is because you're rude, crude, tacky, and disrespectful. Oh, 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 oh. I will stop.